Hi, Pekazian here and in this video I'm going to show you how to work with uh, conditions and control resources. So I made here uh, four jobs in this folder. Uh, rename that folder and the jobs. Uh, fill the required fields as run as and uh, host for all of these jobs and uh, make some conditions. Set up a command here with timeout 5 and then let's let's take a look at these uh, conditions. So first let's rename those conditions from job 2 to job 4 and condition from job 2 to job 3. <laughs> So the job to this is our condition from job two to job three. So let's rename it for a better view. So it will be J two to J three, and this will be J two to J4 and of course we need we need uh, in condition here at job 3 and job 4 so we have to rename it so in two, two, J3 so here, here we have one condition and if we name it here like J2, J4 and we have the conditions. So now uh, let's set up the control resources. So let's name it like uh, control res. Let's copy it and set the type as exclusive. Same to the here. Control resources, paste it and set the type as exclusive. Now let's set up the priority. I'll set up uh, the medium priority here at job 4 and the same priority to job 3. Uh, now we can set up undo actions. Uh, when this job ends uh, it will remove this condition. It will remove condition from job 2 to job 4 or when this job 4 ends, it will remove condition from job 2 to job 3. So, let's click on the job 3 and undo action. When job ended, do add or remove condition. We want to remove and we want to remove condition from job 2 to job 4. So J2 to J4 and here we need when job ended do add remove condition remove and we need to remove condition from job 2 to job 3. So J2 to J3. Hit enter. And those two jobs as a medium priority, that means uh, we never know what start first. So let's try it.
let's order it. And we will see what happens. So the one of them should end it as a green, so end it OK. And one of them should stay as a waiting condition. Yes. So this job uh, is completed and this job is waiting condition. So let's let's try another thing that we want to start uh, this job number four and uh, job number three will stay as uh, as uh, gray color. That means waiting condition. So let's hold this and delete. Switch back to planning, check out. And then we want this job start first. So click to the general tab and set the priority maybe high and this will have low priority and let's see what happens the job 4 should end as a green and the job free should end as a gray. Yes, as expected. So that was our control resources, work with control resources and conditions. Thank you. Bye.